Hey everybody, Mark Agnesi here in the back room at Norman's Rare Guitars. And once again, it is time for Guitar of the Day. Let's see, it's been a crazy, crazy day here. We were understaffed today. Sold 13 guitars, I think. Let's see, Flying V from yesterday, gone. The Hagstrom 8-string bass is gone. Hendrix Estate couldn't keep us from selling it. That one's <laughs> gone. Let's see, the bass 6 that we did on Thumpin' Thursday a couple weeks ago, that one's gone. And this little 57 TV special that I'm kind of pissed I didn't even get a chance to show you guys. But that one's gone too. If you guys like this stuff, uh, you know, you gotta call them by. It's, you gotta call them by quick, man. This stuff goes fast. And when I say guys, I mean guys and girls. I know there's girls that watch this too. Yeah, there's like five of you. There's like five of you out there. I'm here. You're probably being forced to watch this with uh, your husband or your boyfriend or something. But let me be the first to say to you guys, what's up, girl? All right. Uh, let's see. It's freaking Stratter Day, man. I've got one of the most polarizing strats of all times today. Some people are diehard collectors of this color. They want to get absolutely every single model. Some people want to buy them just so they can set them on fire and rid the earth of the humanity. Why don't you guys come back and see what I got for you today. This thing's from 1979. It's the original Fender Stratocaster in Antigua finish. Gross! <laughs> or as I like to call it, pea foam green. It's pretty disgusting. Yeah, oh, did I mention, got the original hang tags, got the original warranty card, got the original case, got all the good stuff. Yeah, Antigua, man, people hate this color. Some people love it. I'm on the fence, man. I dig it on some stuff. Um, this uh, is 79. I think 78 was the first year that they started doing Antigua Strats. Uh, so this is second year of production. Clean as all hell. Got one tiny little uh, dingaroo down there. But uh, other than that, the thing is all straight and very, very clean. Got the black plastic parts on this guy with the wiggle stick. Maple neck is in really, really uh, fantastic shape. We have the original uh, three bolt neck, of course, at this era. And uh, on this one, we do have a factory five-way switch. People will always say on Strategy, man, put it in the two-hole and the four-hole, man. We like to hear what it sounds like there. Old Strats are only three-ways, man. This has a five-way switch in it, which means I got to do five songs. So that's enough talking. Why don't we go out front and start making noise? All right, we're out front. We have the 1979 Fender Stratocast original P-Foam Green Antigua finish. Uh, we got it going through a stock Hot Rod Deluxe today, all the EQs at noon, just a little bit of reverb. Uh, we'll start with a little bit of drive. We got five positions to get through today. Let's start up uh, on the neck pickup on, uh, on its own here. <laughs> drive let's go into position uh, four here it's going to be a combination of the neck pickle uh, neck pickup and middle pickup together here let's see what that guy can do position right in the middle just the middle pickup on its own so let's some drive back on the singer <laughs> Thank you. 
to position two. Now we're listening to the middle pickup and the bridge pickup together. See what that guy can do here. So let's go down to the bridge, see where this thing honks, a little more overdrive. <laughs> It's the most loved and hated color in the history of Fender, uh, Fender's musical instrument designs, Antigua. Some people love it, want to collect them all. Some people want to light them on fire and rid the earth of them. I think it's rad. This one's got original hang tags from 1979. It's as clean as a whistle. Follow me on Instagram at Mark Agnesi. Follow the store at, at Norman's Rare Guitars. And check this and the rest of these guitars out online at normansrareguitars.com. That does it for the week. We will see you guys back here again on Tuesday for a whole new week of guitar of the day. You guys have a great weekend. We'll see you then. Peace.